Hi, Dr. Joe here. I've been talking to you quite a bit about how vitamin D is important in terms of uh, prevention and a lot of other interaction with diseases. But this uh, uh, particular article I'll talk to you about is the control of autoimmune diseases. This is treatment. And of course, it's a lot of diseases and it's not quite uh, apparent how each person would use it for each person's disease. But it's a very interesting um, uh, piece of, of research and a review of the situation. It's from the National Clinical Practice of Rheumatology, uh, 2008 in, in uh, April. Um, and so this is something that is very interesting. And they, they talk about adaptive uh, immunology and they talk about reactive uh, immunology and both playing a role in the treatment of chronic disorders, chronic immune disorders. And so they have a list of kinds of disorders which it should be in, in uh, involved in everything that you'd like to have become better. That includes rheumatoid arthritis, systemic lupus erythematosus, possibly multiple sclerosis, type 1 diabetes is in there again, inflammatory bowel diseases, and autoimmune prostatitis, a new thing that comes up. All these explain a lot of observed phenomenon when people use this. And uh, if you have any of these disorders, this should be looked into by your practitioner to figure out how this could play a role in getting this better controlled for you. And that surely would be the best thing for you. It's your time.